this is for Divine Masculine Taurus. Divine Masculine Taurus. Um, conspiring to do a death spell and plot to kill an emperor for money. All for money that he doesn't even know you, which is really bizarre. Why you would do that to somebody, one of your friends that you've known for a very long time, a best friend. There was an entanglement spell that happened, and since we had to cut the cord, and you and your wife, your spouse, your legal hair, um, you two were in opposite energy. You were in feminine, she was in masculine. Somebody did it an illusion spell, but it didn't work, so that made everybody delusional. And you can't all agree to do something and don't say yes, and then follow through with it anyways, okay? So somebody did an entanglement, we had to cut the cord, the energy just goes where it goes. We tell you it exists for seven months now, there's no control over the backfire. Uh, because you were doing it on an innocent, so it's an automatic backfire. This person didn't do anything to you people. It doesn't matter what everybody else's scenario was in the scene, because... You're accountable for your own actions. They keep trying to blame the emperor. Whoever that was in this scenario. Um, you did that. You give. You gave them these entitlements. You and your wife. It doesn't come like that up in other people's messages. Just you two. You two entitled them that. That that honor. Okay. Now he's trying to say he wasn't part of the scene with the demon exchange, but your essence was in control during your wife's transaction. So, yes, you were. Uh, you keep saying you don't have anything to do with her, but in the last seven months, you two continuously keep doing marriage spells, unity spells. That's very clear when you two are doing spell work together, that you two are together in a union. That can never break. Well, now it broke, but you have all the feminine energy and she has all the masculine, okay? You're back down into your lower level, okay? Doesn't matter what other people's intentions were. You're accountable for your own actions. So everybody's getting in trouble, don't worry. So her, you're in charge of her energy, she's in charge of your energy because we had to break a cord and that's what bounced back, okay? Nothing broke between you two, not the unity or the marriage or the unity ties. You two agree to a divine twin flame unity um, endless, endlessly, which would carry on to the next life. We're in next life now, okay? Well, you could divorce her on a piece of paper. That's not going to get her out of your energy. Oh, wow. Yes, he sold his soul to the devil. Broken hearted over what? Being by yourself. What is this nine of pentacles? Somebody leaving the group. However, he ends do this, being kicked out of the kingdom. This is somebody else leaving though. You're broken hearted because somebody, it wasn't a real group. I told you this from the very beginning. And now you're being kicked out of the community doing this stuff on someone else's property. I don't have to show my table to you. There's a hundred other thousand readers that don't even show their table. So you can't request me to show my table closer, okay? I could just not show my table at all. How about that? <sighs> Page of Cups. You're trying to force an apology to have someone come back to a relationship with a masculine that you're in regret of them leaving the group or something and you're heartbroken over that. Whatever this Nine of Pentacles in a group work. Trying to steal. Well, you open up the gates of confliction and con Congress, I said. Huh. Confliction and chaos. You're having a tower over family members, but it's not real. You keep saying family, but this person had an affair with this family member that you allowed. But it's a family, really? Wow. You know, incense is against the law, right? Okay. Especially in the state of Pennsylvania. It's against the law. <clears throat> and you allow this in your household. And you allow your wife to take commands from another man. Just love that one. To steal. The will. For the will to turn in your favor. The same as the feminine. So we still need the feminine story. Because his story came out on her feminine. Yeah, working in a group. With all your strength, you are going to get someone else's will to turn in your favor. For what? 
Taurus, confirmation. Fast movement forward. Everything that just come piling into you. Oh, you got a big pile. Big pile of burdens and the door slamming in your face this time with the gate put down on top of it and the lock. Why? Wow, Yins are the ones that are getting kicked out of the community. So why would you make an attachment for him to stay? Doesn't make any sense. When you're the one that has to leave, okay? Fast movement, fast movement forward. It's being confirmed twice because yins are begging and out of money. But for whatever reason, you both are single, full-time jobs, no kids, no nothing, no car payments, no nothing. Trailer paid off and all, but you're broke. And this is the community's problem because... Did you make the fake money going around? No. Do you know who's that you know who has the fake money? Okay, you know who has it, but you don't know who printed it. Okay. Okay, thank you for that. Well, if you don't report it, you're automatically conspiring with it, okay? Because it came from your drawer in the bag to the bank. Duh. Completely gone. Him and his spouse completely gone. To win it all costs, what, a friendship? You were friends. For money to keep being entangled through the friendship is what this is all about. Because it's been confirmed three times, okay? When he does, he's a paying customer down there, both of them. And that's not enough for you. Overcharging for fake drinks that are seven times the legal limit, it was not enough for you. You and her are the ones that decided to kick everybody out of there and bar all of them, okay? You and her are together in a union, a legal union, a relationship. And it doesn't matter who does it and doesn't do it, okay? You're in a, a relationship, a union with her. <sighs> Page of Wands. Jeans were openly talking about this through text messages to sacrifice somebody's high priestesship. We have it on record through text messaging and messenger to sacrifice somebody. And the other people that facilitated the gang stock, we have it on record to stab somebody that came out of your spouse's mouth. Okay? So I really would run while you have the chance, okay? Death. Here we go. Here's the death here. And you don't wonder why your phones are hacked. Okay. Four of Cups. Because somebody rejected you, so you're putting it to death. Really? You, you were the one that got kicked out of the kingdom and not the community. So it has nothing to do with rejection. I mean, these signs are posted in every single elementary teacher's room. While the frowny face and how do you feel? It's in the nurse's room, the doctor's office, your teacher's everywhere. Nobody from the school district can describe their feelings. Why? You were rejected and kicked out of the community. There's nothing about having feelings involved in this. <laughs> you care about people's feelings, but then you're putting hits out on people. People's lovers and best friends. For no reason at all. They did absolutely nothing to you. Because you got kicked out of the community. You did. No two shits about all your paying customers that are loyal and faithful and in there every day giving you their paychecks. You just want to kill somebody and knock them off the face of the earth, a complete innocent, because you are heartbroken because you got kicked out of the community. Because somebody walked away from a fake crowd. That was the plan. Put somebody to death here. And now you're trapped in your head over this. Over this page energy. Spying on people for no damn reason at all. And it was a wish fulfillment to put who to death, please. Gemini. Yes. Come up confirmation twice. For money. They made a deal with the devil to put Gemini to death. Behind the moon. Him and Pisces. And then put a block on it to sacrifice him. Him and Justice. But their intentions were... Um, Gemini. So that all the money and all their love would just flow to them and they could harvest high priestess energy somehow when those two would make love. <laughs> wow. 
Wow. Sexually frustrated. Um, yes, a man almost 50 sexually frustrated out in the community into the world. Heartbroken. His little heart got hurt, too. I mean, yeah, we definitely got an eye on you, buddy. Heartbroken. Because God, we had to come in and do a divine intervention here. Because you're going alone in the moon, you and Pisces. That's where you're going on in groundwork. And she's in hell. It doesn't, still, it looks like you're not in hell yet. I mean, you keep saying you sold your soul, but I don't see that once again. She's entangled on to you. You don't get another devil. Once you use it and it gets caught, you don't get another devil. Okay, you were just going to cut everybody up. I mean, here's you. Your little thing is down in the ground, down in hell, because she sold absolutely everybody and everyone in her life. So your foot is stuck down in there with her, and there's you. Oh, my Pisces, where are you? Oh, my heart broken. I'm horny. I'm 50 and horny. And heartbroken. But I'm still married and don't have no kids and have my whole life in front of me. Two businesses, cars paid off, trailer paid off, everything. But I'm going to kill somebody for money and love when you have all that. And you want me to believe that there is nothing wrong going on inside your head. Okay. And sexually frustrated. And heartbroken because... You are committing crimes and got kicked out of the community. <sighs> All over there it says you wanted magic because this person took their magic and left the relationship and it never was a relationship because you're married, okay? Now you need to get your delusions figured out in your head. Anything else, please? I'm going to stop for now. Yeah, we're putting this situation to rest. Thank you. 